Hey guys, welcome home. Today I'm gonna teach you how to connect vMix application to your Zoom application. Without any further ado, let's get in the house. To start, so I have already opened uh, the vMix application here in my desktop and the Zoom application and I have already created a new meeting. So this is the main interface of the, base, uh, the vMix application. So as you can see, it is divided into four um, frames. We have here the frame with a, a green label colored and we have here uh, a frame with orange labeled uh, screen and there are the two frames which is separated in the left and the right side and we have here the audio mixer so and we have here also um, buttons and functionalities that you can use in setting up our vmix application so to this tutorial we are going to connect the vmix application to your zoom as uh, the main source of your display in a zoom application in your meeting so let's start by adding an input to our screen here so to add an input just select at the lower left side of the um, vmix application just click the add input and wait for a while and you can see um, a new window appear and a list of um, sources of your inputs is displayed so you can choose from here so we have here video DVD list camera desktop capture image sequence and so on and so forth so this time we are going to try the list so the list uh, you can add a list of videos here or audio files just click here the add button and select from your folder so for example if we're going to select all of this music video then click open and automatically all the files that you have selected will be displayed in the list of videos then you can shuffle it clear or remove uh, the files that you have added so <clears throat> just click the ok and automatic it will be displayed at the main screen of the vmix application so since the green screen or the labeled green or the main screen of vmix is the one is being populated with list of videos then automatically if we're going to play this one okay so it is now playing in the main screen but this time it's not yet connected to the zoom application so let's try another just try to open the list here and then we can see here the list of videos so you can choose this uh, from one video to another and play the So you can also adjust the audio of the video by just clicking the audio mixer right beside the list. Okay, so it is full. So just click, uh, just lower down the volume and then let's play again and let's see and let's hear. Okay, the audio is already adjusted. So this time let's create another uh, input. Just click this one and then click the add input so this time we're going to add photos just click this one and then browse click image browse this one so we will going to click the image and click ok and as you can see in the main interface of vmix application we have here a list of video and on the other side is an image so we can switch um, from one screen to another by just clicking here the transition it, 
could you can use the fade transition, the merge transition, or the wipe transition, and so on and so forth. So this time, um, the wa uh, the one that is being displayed in the main screen is the image. So you can switch it from one to another. So since we have um, two two frames here, we will just add another one by just clicking the add input. So this time we are going the in the eye or the desktop capture. So and click the local desktop capture. So by the way, guys, so I have set up two main uh, main display here. At we have here uh, the one that we have the VMix application and Zoom is the display one, and the display two is the YouTube page. So just by clicking the display two. So we have here, just click this one and it will be automatically placed to the left side of the screen. And if we're going to click, uh, to show it in the main screen, just click the transition, fade or merge, uh, merge or wipe. Okay, so uh, in, the, in our main screen, we can see here the YouTube um, page, you just click here. To see it if it's working okay what is being displayed in the hey guys, display to so what is being displayed in the display to will be captured by the vmix application so we have already three um, display here we have here a list of video an image as well as a desktop capture which is the display number two so this time guys, are you now excited? We are going to show to you how to display the display from the VMix application to the Zoom application. So without any further ado, let's just uh, go to our Zoom application. Uh, I have already opened it and as you can see the main uh, display in the Zoom application is the camera that is I am now talking to you and I am using this as my audio input in the zoom so we were going to select set up on how we are going to connect the vmix to the zoom application um, in the lower part uh, we have here uh, audio icon just click this arrow up and an option will displayed <clears throat> so select the vmix video yv12 Click this one. <clears throat> As you can see, nothing. Uh, um, a rainbow of colors appeared. So uh, it is uh, indication that um, VMix application and Zoom is not yet connected. To display the VMix application main display to Zoom, let's go to VMix and at the lower side we have here an external. <clears throat> Just click the external button and chada the vmix application and zoom are now connected so let's try to play so that is how we are going to connect um, vmix application to your zoom so this time we are going to switch from one display to another so let's try to play the <clears throat> the list of video by clicking this one and automatically it will be displayed in the other side of the vmix application and let's switch now click merge and it is now playing and as you can see in as you can see in um, the zoom application it is now playing but um we were going to to set up also the audio audio settings of the zoom so that whatever is the output from the vmix application audio will be going into the zoom audio also as an output just unmute it and it is um, now playing because the main source of the audio is the USB audio device. This one, I am 
I am using. So, in order to switch the audio input from VMix application, just click the cable output or the virtual uh, audio cable. And then, let's play the let's see if uh, it, the audio from vmix will be detected in our zoom just play this one and let's adjust the audio okay. so as you can see the audio in output from vmix is being input to the zoom application so it is working since the indication of volume is running from lower to down let's try and that's it so now the audio and the video output from vmix application is being inputted to the zoom application so let's try another display this one uh, this image and then you choose fade as so this is the image so we can easily switch from one display to another in vmix as well as the audio input in zoom application so that's all just remember i'm just teaching you the basic and how to connect the vmix application thank you thank you for watching and please uh, click the like button and don't for forget to subscribe and Comment down below if you have suggestions or clarification. This is Malyamo Ferds. Till next time, adios.